Welcome to AppChasers.com. Today we're going to take a look at how to scan recipes that you've torn out of magazines into Evernote. To do that, we're going to use the iPhone and we're going to use a neat app called PDF Pen Scan Plus. With this method, you can uh, basically collect all your recipes, whether they're found on the internet or found... Uh, maybe in some magazines that you've torn the page out of, or even in cookbooks that you have lying around. You can save all your favorite recipes uh, to Evernote. So we'll show you how to do that right now. Now this method is taking a, a scan using the iPhone and PDF Pen Scan Plus. So let's open the app right now. We'll show you how it works. So I've got PDF Pen Scan Plus open. We'll touch the camera button in the lower middle of the screen. And we'll go to a well-lit area, we'll place our page on the table, and all we need to do is line it up with the edges of the screen here and tap the camera button. Take a picture of it, and uh, it'll bring it right in here to PDF Pen Scan Plus. Okay, so you can see we've now got our scanned document right here in our documents view of PDF Pen uh, Scan Plus. So we'll tap on that. Now show us that we have a couple of things that we can do. We've framed the picture pretty well here, but we can also click on the crop button at the bottom and it'll automatically find the edges of the document. We don't really need to do that right now because uh, it already has found those, but you can see we can go ahead and adjust those edges as well, just in case we were a little skewed in taking our picture. So we'll cancel out of that and we'll go back to our view here of editing this document. We can also determine if it's a black and white document scan that we want, a grayscale scan, or a color scan. In this uh, instance we want to use the color. We can also change our brightness level here, right here on this uh, little slider bar at the bottom. Okay, so we'll cancel out of that. We don't need to make any adjustments with that. Now the neat thing that PDF Pen Scan Plus does is it OCRs the document. You can see this OCR button in the upper right hand corner. That stands for Optical Character Recognition. This pulls out the words from your a picture that you've taken with your iPhone here and it converts those words from a flat image into a searchable highlightable document uh, that you can find when we upload it to Evernote. So that's in case you want to um, search for a recipe that has a certain ingredient in it, you can search for that ingredient. And uh, now that you've OCR this document, it'll recognize that word within the PDF and uh, pull it out. So let's OCR this right now. We'll show you how it works. We'll click on that button in the upper right. We'll hit OCR page. Now watch what happens as it uh, recognizes the words in this scan and uh, converts them into text within the PDF. And when you do this, you want to make sure that the picture you take is very clear. And now you can see it's finding all the words here in this document, highlighting them, and then it's going to convert them to searchable, highlightable text within our PDF here. So all those yellow uh, highlighted words there, it can now recognize. And it's, we'll show you what it does next here. It's pretty neat how it converts those into uh, actual digital text. Okay, now it has all the text that it's found. We can zoom in here. And you can see it's not perfect, but it does uh, get some pretty good uh, job here. It'll pull out those key words that you'll want to search for later. So you can zoom in and see how good of a job it did. We'll go back to our main documents view here. Now that we're done uh, OCRing the document, we can uh, tap on the name here. We can rename this. So we'll just say sandwich for now. We'll hit OK. Now let's go back into that uh, actual document here. You can add new uh, pages from the camera, your photo library, or importing from another source like Dropbox. Um, but right now this is the only page that we need for this recipe. Let's click the share button in the lower left and we can upload to a number of services like Google Drive, Evernote, or Dropbox. But if you have the Evernote app already on your phone, um, you can open it right within the app. And we found that that works a little bit better. You can also uh, view this in the Evernote food app, which we really like 
for viewing our recipes, and we'll show you what that looks like. Right now, let's open it in our Evernote app. We'll scroll over to Evernote. We'll click that. It's going to pull it into Evernote here, and we need to hit save in the upper right corner. So we'll hit save, and now watch what happens. There's our sandwich recipe right there, and it's uploading as we speak. Okay, now it's done. And you can view it right here by downloading it to your device in Evernote. But the better way to view your recipes in Evernote is using the Evernote Food app. So let's go over, over into the Evernote Food app. And you can see I've got it open already right here. And uh, let's go back to our main view here. And that's the My Cookbook uh, tab that we want to select to find our recipes. So we'll tap on that. And you can see that we've got all of our recipes already uh, already listed in a nice format here in Evernote Food. So there it is. It looks pretty good. A nicely scanned uh, recipe that we've got right here in Evernote Food. So that's a great way to scan in your loose uh, recipes from a cookbook or a magazine using PDF Pen Scan Plus and Evernote.